Hello everyone, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to send files over the network very fast with a program called Warpinator. So Warpinator, I really like it. I mean, I use a lot of different ways for transferring files around, but I do work with virtual machines a lot. And uh, my virtual machines are often connected to the network and the fastest way to send a file from say my main, my main desktop to the VM is with this program because you can send and receive. So I've got Debian here running Warpinator. I'm just gonna open it up and I've got my Arch Linux system running Warpinator as well. So now if I want to send a file, I just gotta wait for it to initialize. Gotta make sure that I have the app installed on both systems. So please follow the instructions in the description to install on both systems. But as you can see here, I have uh, my VM right here. I use OS boxes a lot because they have pre-configured VMs you can download for VirtualBox. You don't have to go through the process of configuring it and setting it up. Just a quick little tip, by the way. But uh, I can send a file to the VM like so. I can click on the VM, find send files. And let's see, we can go for browse and we'll send anything. So I have a lot of arch stuff. Let's say the sticky deb package that I built yesterday for something. I can send it and then over here on the other machine, the one that's send it, getting the files, I can just click the accept button. And uh, we can see if I click here, we can see that the file was completed and transferred. And now I can see it's over here and I can actually access if, you know, if I want to install the package, I can do sudo apt install, actually I'll log into root sudo apt install and I can install the program you know dependency issues and whatnot but I can get the program I can send files I can send anything so if I want to send uh, let's say this key file here that I have for some reason to my arch system I can go up here or is it Just click on the person click send files key and then I can go on my system over here click approve and then I see this key file is right here for Yoli for Debian so now naturally Warpinator should work on every Linux desktop and uh, if you have problems getting it working go ahead and check out the article in the description but this is a foolproof really easy way of sending files back and forth like I know some people like to use bash upload that little command line website. There's also, you know, transfer.sh we've covered in the past, and there are, you know, NitroShare and all this other stuff. But Warpinator is my favorite just because of how seamless and fast it is. Like, you find something that you want to send. It can even be folders. So, like, you know, if I if I want to send something in my Dropbox folder, I can do that too. You can send pretty much anything over the network, and it works just fine. And all you got to do is approve it, and it's it's instantaneous. It's it's really just impressive. I really like the app, so please check that out. Uh, this is how you send files over the network with Warpinator. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next one.